Hello. Today is Easter Sunday. I'm not with my family. I'm alone. Everyone also thinks I'm like alone all the time. I kind of am. I just got a comment that was like, you really know how to make loneliness look aesthetic. And you know, I'm not sure to take that, but it's true. And I thought, bring a sprung in New York. Let's enjoy. In true form, I decided to spend today like how I spend pretty much every free day, every weekend, by going to cafes. I absolutely love it. Cafes are my love language. I've been doing this since the start of high school. I don't really know if I'm ever going to stop. It's just, it can be any vibe you want. You can work, you can watch people, you can think, you can meet friends. It's really just open for whatever you want and it's better than sitting at home not doing anything. And even if you don't want coffee or no work to do, it's always a fun time. And I like to go to this bookstore next to my favorite cafe. It's called McNally Jackson. Don't really get much, but it's still fun. I just went grocery shopping and I, you know, I don't really know. I don't know how other cities, urban environments work, but I can just tell you grocery shopping in New York is, oh my God, it's really not good. It's hard. It's like, it's, it's good to finish it, but it's just, if you grew up not in an urban environment or like had a car, nothing beats going to the grocery store, packing your car and driving away. Luggaging things through town, windy, cold, I don't know, whatever you want to, it's not cold today. Windy, heavy, it's rough, but you know, I'm deciding I'm done being negative and I'm being positive, so at least I can do that. At least I can walk and do that. Some people can, and I'm grateful for the little things. I haven't eaten though. I haven't been hungry, and I I don't know if I mentioned this and I, you know, it's kind of embarrassing. I had a whole tub of Hagen Dots last night. Don't look at the nutrition label and don't tell me. I just know you're not supposed to do that. The entire tub, one sitting. And that might have just kept me going for a while, but I'm a little hungry. I'm gonna make a little lunch situation. I don't know. I have an avocado, chickpeas. For rice, sometimes I get in like a good mood and I make quinoa. Otherwise, I get this Trader Joe's frozen rice medley. I got it today and this woman was like, hey, do you like it? And I was like, oh my God, I love it. It's amazing, you need to get it. I went on this long feel about how amazing it is. And I just know she was like, all right, can't be that good, babe. It's frozen rice. I made it sound like I was going to Nobu. <laughs> but no, baby, we're in the frozen food section of the TJ. Okay, you know lunch is served. It's 4 30. It's a little crazy dinner soon Um, it looks honestly actually pretty good and I will say enough hot sauce on anything. It's delicious I'm gonna eat it and watch the Kardashians lately I've been in a reality TV vibe, which is honestly not like me But I feel like regular television has been pretty depressing that sometimes you just need Kris Jenner to make you feel really warm and at home. So that's been my vibe lately. I had lunch. I laid here for a while because there was just a lot on my plate. Not physically, but in life. I need to go to the gym. I need to go to the gym. I don't want to. I really don't. But people can do hard things and they can also finish a tub of and dust. So if I can do that, I should be able to make it to the gym. My little submarine. Gotta love her. Except I have used the help button once. I did get stuck and the fire department had to pry me out. It was 1 a.m. That was a dark night, but still love you, girl. Okay, I'm disregarding the gym. I'm just gonna walk and soak in the energy. It is also because no one's at the gym and I have stage fright, so we're enjoying Mother Nature. Fun fact about me, I moved to the West Village having no clue how amazing the West Village is and how lucky I am, and that was just a good karma I cashed in. It is beautiful here. I think this is the prettiest walk ever. There's so many cherry blossoms. Okay, that walk was needed. Because I had some late lunch, I'm not hungry. So I'm just gonna have some bone broth. It looks really weird on camera. Like, not okay, but it's good, I promise. Before I do that, actually, I think I might shower again. I like already showered, but I've tackled the day. So I think I wanna wash New York City off and then I can get in my bed feeling like a little princess. If I ever get robbed, I'd start laughing. I'd be like, I don't even know what to do. If anyone wants an updated skincare routine, I am listing it here. These are the things I use. I don't know if it's called almond oil or just oil, but definitely recommend. If you're looking for um, an anti-aging, I recommend the SkinCeuticals Age Interrupted Advance. I love it. Cool. Also been wearing this Kiehl's Avocado Eye Cream. Highly recommend. Okay guys, 
guys, I think it's time for bed. I had a lot of work to do. I didn't do it. I think I'll get to it tomorrow. One thing I've noticed in this video is that I need a haircut. I think I want to try. I always let my hair get long because I want to do like a, like a, not a middle part, but like a flowy vibe. And my hair is just kind of too curly for that and too wild. I had such an amazing day. I hope you all had the best this time and sleep well. Or if your day's just starting, good morning. And if it's midday, you got this. Love you all. Good night.